Hello Internet, um, me again. Um, for a change, it stopped raining. It was supposed to be thunderstorms for the next three or four days, but we've actually got a little bit of, um, up there, look, blue sky. Anyway, um, I know the content at the moment's been a bit all over the place, a lot of drone footage, but that's because of a lot of the weather and um, we've had a lot of things going on, uh, as you may know. But today, little Joe on the Tigra behind me. Um, let me show you what the problem is. So to be honest, it's a pretty common problem. Um, it's just the rubber on the aerial, it's disintegrated. So I bought myself a new one. So um, I'm now gonna take the rubber off and put a new one on. That's the plan anyway. We should see what happens. Mm. So there we go, got the top off just to make things a bit easier. First job, I believe, I've never done this before, so you're joining me for the first time. I'm gonna have to get that light out because I'm assuming that the nut and bolt that holds it in place is behind there. And there's the new rubber, of course, quality stuff from China. Have you noticed, by the way, um, eBay now is adding VAT onto goods from China, even second-hand ones. Hmm. Bizarre. Right, so I'm assuming this just pops off, so we'll get the uh, lever under there, and uh, it does. Oh, look at that, how easy is that? Um, what we got? Right, we have got a plug, which is fine, and we've got a nut up there. So yeah, this looks yeah, relatively easy. <laughs> I shouldn't have said that, should I? No, no, you shouldn't. Okay, so I've got the block connector out of the way. Um, all I did was yeah, use the pry just to, to get in there and pop it out. And it seemed to snap out okay. Um, no damage done. Right, looks like I have got to take uh, a wire off. Um, where's that wire go? Mm, okay, maybe I don't. Maybe I can just unloosen that and, and thread it round. Yeah. Right, let's get the bolt out and uh, we'll decide what to do. Right, so 17 mil seems to be the kitty. Let's, uh, let's get that out. And yeah, this is this is good um, good videography. Yeah, so ah, there we go. So yep, just unscrewed it like so. So I'm going to lift it up now, and hopefully I can thread this new rubber under without having to do anything else. Right, so it's obviously loose now, like so. And um, yeah, that comes out like so. <laughs> I was doing where to hold on and not leak, to be honest. Right, I'm going to give this a little bit of a clean up too. <sighs> right, I like all Chinese rubbish. It doesn't fit. Some might inclined to say that that was a complete and utter waste of time, and um, I would totally agree. It was a complete and utter waste of time. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I've got some rubber glue, and I've stuck the old one down. It ain't pretty, but um, I've got to find another solution, because obviously the one I got ain't no good. Hmm, slightly annoying, but there you go. Maybe I'm going to have to buy an original item at about 60 or 70 quid, no doubt. Anyway, I'm going to bolt it all back up again now and forget I ever started this. Um, so if you've come here looking for a way to change this, then hopefully in the future I'll be able to put a link to where you can get them from. Um, but you can actually see how to get to it and undo it. If it's any use to you, well done. <laughs> right, I've had enough of this now. Catch you later. Bye bye. Thank you.